three things that would get me all the way out to Rockford just for a food truck. Burgers, beer, and of course, a suggestion on Facebook. So thank you, Matthew Gibbons, for suggesting Falkenstein. This one is for the Rockford Files. This is Jim Rockford. So Falkenstein. Yes. Explain to me the concept. I'm getting the Stein part. I'm thinking Frankenstein. Ah. Am I on the right track? It's kind of a mad marriage between craft beer and gourmet street food. Oh, no. Everything we do on the truck has beer in it of some sort. It allows me to create strange things and hope I like them. You are a Dr. Frankenstein. <laughs> there you go, a Dr. Forkenstein. And everything that they have on their menu is infused with some type of a beer. There's so much you can do with beer. Are you allowed to drink beer this, this age? No. No? Are you enjoying the fact there's beer inside? <coughs> yeah. It's made with love, it's made with beer, and it's really delicious. It's the best I'll ever have. What makes you guys Chicago's best food truck? We kind of craft the dish around whatever beer that we get at the time and run with it from there. Okay, it's happy hour for me. Crack one open, dude. Okay, let's go, let's cook. We're gonna make the Swamp Thing. Why Swamp Thing? This truck allows me to be a nerd with everything that I love. Food, beer, horror movies, comic books, everything. Grab a couple patties. Uh, inside that, we have an American adjunct ale mixed in with steak seasonings and fresh ground beef. I feel like I'm working as an assistant to a crazy scientist who's creating some monsters. So you would be Igor? Yes, and master. We've got our bacon. Bacon! <laughs> Two things, Andrew. What does everything taste better with? Beer and? Bacon. And this has both. Today we're gonna to use a 2013 Pepe Nero from Goose Island. Good year, good choice. It's got a little bit of peppery kind of notes in there that'll help bring out the hearty, beefy flavor of the burgers and the salad. We should toast to your creation. Cheers, sir. To monsters, to your creations. To burgers. To you, to Fork and Stain. You got your two split Biroche buns. There's beer infused into the buns. A little hefty set of bacon for each one. This so. is the swamp sauce. Cajun hot sauce infused aioli. Colby Jack. And you're good. That's really all you need. Cheese, beer, bacon. I think that's all the food groups are. Shut up and eat your beer. It's time, people. I'm excited we finally get to eat your creation. You get to eat your beer. That's the thing I'm excited about because it's the Roma Street. We can't really legally <coughs> drink beer, but I get to eat my Goose Island, so. That is alive in my belly. It's alive! That's so damn good. This guy, Andrew, from Falkenstein, is genius. Crunch of the bacon, the softness of the patty. The burger has a nice savory flavor from the beer and the onions and that. This is great. Thanks, guys, again for letting us know about this. Plink it out. Oh. Again. It's alive, damn it! It's alive!